Hey there, FPV pilots, smooth virus, call sign virus, with you here in the morning, shooting this in the morning, so I can get this out to you tonight. Um, just thought I'd go over real quick with my uh, Wing Wing Z84 project. So, uh, I've been working on this oh, a few days. Uh, basically, I've got a Wing Wing Z84. I got it from Banggood, <laughs> just like uh, a lot of other stuff recently. And uh, what I want to do is make this FPV and gonna run iNav in it. So, so far I've assembled the, the wing itself and um, I got the motor mounted in it. I just I put the propeller on just to kind of see how it would fit. It just barely clears the back part of the wing, but I guess that's enough. We're running a... You can't really see it now. It's a sunny sky. 2208, I think. 1500 KV. I'm going to run this on 4S. I got a couple of 4S 1300 milliamp hour batteries. I hope that's big enough to balance it out. This is a little bit bigger motor than um, a lot of other people run in this model. Uh, there's some online spreadsheets where everybody compares like uh, power setups and efficiency on this plane. And a lot of people are running 1800 size motors, but yeah, I got a, I got a 22 in here. I'm kind of shooting for a, a balance between efficiency and speed. So. This isn't going to be like a super hot rod that goes 120 miles an hour. But, you know, you go that fast, you can only stay up five minutes. So, we're looking, you know, to be able to go fast, but also to kind of cruise along. So, we're going to be putting the Omnibus F3 Pro in there. Now, I haven't done much with this yet, but the plan's going to be to... Uh, uh, flash well I've already flashed it with iNav and you see I put I already put some standoffs in here so I'm just gonna once I get the pin soldered on I'm gonna mount it right there like that and you know I saw another uh, build video someone posted just recently where they were using a power distribution board and now that I'm looking at it there might be enough room for me to put a power distribution board in there. So I'm going to think about that. Uh, I don't think I need it though. But I'm going to use that. And we also got a, a Hobby Wing 30 amp speed controller. I'm going to have to cut this uh, cut this um, connector off. This is an EC3. It took me a second to think of it. It's still in the morning, man. <laughs> Coffee hasn't kicked in. Yeah, I'm going to have to cut this off and uh, I guess hook this up. I think this is going to wind up going straight to the flight controller if I'm not incorrect. So that's going in there. Uh, I don't have the cable, but this is going to be my GPS antenna. This is just like the $12 one from Banggood. I think it goes like this. Probably mounted in the wing, like right there or something, right about there. That should work. Uh, we're also going to have the Runcam Micro Swift. I am surprised at how small this thing is. This is a tiny camera. So we'll mount this up here in the nose. And then a couple of my favorite Emacs. Metal Gear servos. These are the little $8 Metal Gear servos. These are great. I've been using these all year and uh, I had great performance out of these things. I really like these. Uh, and the pricing is really reasonable. Well, you can see I just left some glue out. You know, this is, I used Doohoo Pour to put it together. And I actually I mounted the motor mount up with, uh, with some Mercury CA. So. Hopefully that'll work. <laughs> Mercury, I used I used a CA to mount the uh, little uh, standoffs as well. So that's our project so far. I'm gonna be working on this. Hopefully I can finish it up before um, 
it gets too cold. But uh, I do fly in the winter, I just don't fly quite as much based on weather. But uh, I can deal with some cold. So, yeah, I guess uh, this will be flown some this winter and uh, we'll see how it goes. I'll keep you guys updated on our build and you guys will get to see the maiden and uh, subsequent flights. So, all right, yeah, that's my that's my wing wing. Here's the here's the manual. Yay. <laughs> uh, anyway, so uh, we'll be seeing you soon. And oh, I got a uh, I got an email from Banggood this morning about the F1 wing debacle. So I'll let you guys know what happens with that. I haven't decided what I'm gonna do yet. Uh, I just got it like an hour ago. So anyway. I'm going to uh, put all this stuff away and head off, head off to work, to the old nine and nine to five, and uh, yeah, we'll have more content soon. You guys have a good one. Smooth virus, signing off. <laughs>